There. Right. One moment. I hear absolutely nothing. I guess the tile, I guess the screen just doesn't have music. All right. Slightly off putting, but all right. So uh, this is Tech Wars Online. And what's interesting about this is that I played Tech Wars Online 2 a while back, and it was kind of a top-down down, uh, mech, not exactly top-down, kind of isometric, I guess, uh, mech game where you ran and shoot other mechs. And I thought it was okay. Um, but I do have to say, like, I found out in the few, in, like, I found out, like, apparently Tech Wars Online 1 and also Tech Wars Online 2 at a different time, they were banned. Uh, they were banned on Steam for a while, and from what I understand, the reasoning behind that was, well, the developer says complicated negoti nego negotiation with Valve. Uh, but I believe... Oh. Oh, thank you, Zero. I had a weird sound glitch happen. Whoops. Hold on a second. Beep, beep, boop. <laughs> Hello, new viewers. But hope everybody's doing good. But yeah, so basically, this game, uh, I don't really know what happened. I think the developer got shut down by Valve for a while. I don't. I, I, I knew the details at one point, but I kind of forgot at this point. Uh, but let's see here. Can I find out the reason? I, I don't know. People are talking about it in Russian, but I can't read that. So, anyways. There's kind of some drama going on with the series. But anyways, I got handed the key for Tech Wars Online 1 for some reason, so let's... Oh, there is sound of the game. Good. <laughs> it was, I was kind of wondering for a second. Uh, let's see. I'm awfully developing a new type of weapon that's using state funds. Colluded with the American corporation Kato to seize power in Russia. Their treacherous plan fell apart, leading to full-scale military struggle between Russia and the USA. Being in turn from a traitor to the country's main protector. Oh, okay. And then Kata has to create new types of weapons for the moment of its founding. By bribing the leadership of the Russian Corporation Dominion, Kato intended to take over Russia and then the entire world. After an unsuccessful attempt to incite a revolution that triggered a global war, the Kato Corporation moved to openly participate in the middle military conflict. Okay. I mean, let's play Kato because red's cool. Yeah, Valve Blacklist. I don't know the details, but, uh... I probably wouldn't get involved in this except for the fact that... Well... When I get here's my rules. Whenever I get handed a, a Riki, I I grab it. I take it. All right, let's let's do a tutorial, I guess. All right. What's strange is already this seems more polished than Tech Wars Online 2. I don't want to say like an acid flip was going, but I don't really know the details. All right, so. Uh huh. Camera movement. Okay, this is weird. Okay. So Tech Wars Online 2 was kind of a real-time strategy game where you just moved at your own leisure, I guess. But I guess this is more, like, grid-based. Interesting. All right. Uh, you want me to... Okay. Like, what? Want me to do there? All right. That didn't look like he was in the target line, but okay. Uh, what's this? Intern? Yeah, sure. Okay. Uh, rotates. I mean, yeah, look at this. Like, doesn't it look like I'm, I'm just short of hitting him? Is that just me, right? That looks, that looks like I'm just short of hitting him. I mean, I guess there is a Tardic Ramble. It wouldn't make more sense if that hexagon square was... Well, if that hexagon uh, honeycomb was also red, the one he's standing on. Kind of confusing, but all right. Oh, you know, I forgot something. Boop. Nope, not that one. Boop. There we go. I forgot my timer. Anyways. Okay, being range missiles, sure. Again, I really wish his square was red, because that 
especially in this situation, it looks like I, he is a actually out of range. But, alright. Use your right arm to co cover from the enemy's next shot. Alright. What I want to use my weapon arm is defense. That's weird. See, you lost your right arm. There you go. But save this from direct hit to the body. Alright. Our mech spy has zero armor. If we hadn't used our armor for cover, we'd have lost. It's preferred to avoid shots of the body. Okay. So facing does matter. That's cool. I understand. I'm okay with this system. Let's see. Defeat the enemy mech with missiles only. Alright. New tasks available. Likes firing the cannon. What? Alright. I'm glad that the mech enjoys using a particular weapon. I don't I don't know why mechs have preferences, but I'm sure. Uh I see. Hello, Ivy. Hmm. Can I, like, get more cannon ammo? Nope. Okay. Well, alright. I guess I'll just go into skirmish, then. Ah, okay. Wait, am I finding an actual person? I don't know. I don't think I am, but it's still heavy waiting for some reason. Uh, all right, let's wait. Bork, bork, and bork. All right, I got this. Yes, I think it. Like what? What's wrong here? So I need to. I mean, wait. Am I, it's, again, okay. Is he is he in the circle or not? I have no idea. I guess he isn't. All right. And you can't undo a move, I assume. All right. Okay, well, anyways. See, that's what I mean, it's confusing, but he wasn't apparently in range, all right. I'm gonna break his weapon if I can. No. Where's he going? Back here, fiend. Can't tell what I'm doing. It's hard to tell what exactly I'm attacking, though. Like, at this angle, what do you think would get hit? It appears the answer is the boss. Actually, I don't know what I hit. I'm not entirely sure what I hit. Yeah, actually, I'm a little confused about that. This should hit the other arm, right? I don't know. What, wait, I, I don't know what I hit. Nothing, none of the numbers changed. None of the numbers changed down there, so what did I hit? Oh, wait, is this my... Wait, I can't see his health, can I? Oh, okay. I'm, this is only my health. This is my health. I'm looking. I'm stupid. Sorry. He's just walking away from me. He just doesn't. He just, he's like, "Fuck you! I'm leaving." All right. I'll just get you in the back then. All right. Cool. 
Well, I guess I can't see his stats. I thought I could see his stats, so that's weird. Would appreciate being able to see his stats. Direct aim weapon, cool. I mean, it looks like I can't do anything with skirmishes. So let's do keep keep doing skirmishes, I guess. Wait, click and hold scroll wheel to move camera? That's a weird way to move the camera. Alright, well. Oh, like that. I get you. I get it. Uh let's see here. I mean, theoretically, if I move here. Oh. Oh, I ran out of movement points, I guess. Wait, actually, where are my movement points? I don't even know. Oh, you can hit me from there? God damn it. Actually, yeah, what are my movement points? Like, where where, do the, where are those displayed? I'm, I'm trying to figure that out now. I'm gonna rotate. Okay, so I have, like, three, I guess? Anyways, I should be able to... Yep. Okay, that's more powerful, I see. He's just gonna stand there and not give a shit. Alright, he's moving, never mind. So, like, for instance, I could... Hmm... I'm not in his. I'm not in range to hit him. Does that mean he's not in range to hit me? Of course, he can move back in range and attack. But I kind of want to see because if I move over there, I run out of movement points. I think so. I'm gonna wait. Let him move first. What are you gonna do about it? All right. Hmm. No, I'm, I'm waiting. You do something. Aha! Now you're in my trap. Ow. The reason I want him to move is now I can move one square. Oh wait, Zachary took two movement points. Oh fuck me. All right, fine. Okay, I guess just moving in general takes a movement point. All right. Oh wait, now I, I still have a movement point though. What? Can I move and shoot in the same turn? I'm confused now. I thought I couldn't. I thought if I ran out of movement points, I couldn't shoot. I'm so confused how this game works. Oh, look at him just walking up to me. All right. Boom. Oh, my body is really beat up, so let's see. I'm going to protect from my right. Yes, that'll do. Uh oh. Is that going to hit me? Okay. So why did the- okay, I moved once and that took three movement points. What? But last time it took two. What? Why? I don't understand. Whatever, I guess I'll shoot. I'm so confused right now. So, uh, wait, how many movement points does it take? One move, and I lose all my movement points. Okay. Is that just how that works? I don't, I don't know. There, don't, now you don't have an arm. Fuck you. <laughs> He's just like, I don't give a shit. Rough terrain? Maybe? Okay, that's how I used two movement points to move that square. I don't understand, though, because it... Hold on. Wait, no, there's nothing different... Wait, what? That doesn't make any sense. There's no there's no difference between any of these squares, and yet moving from that square to that square took three movement points, and moving from that square to this square took two. I don't understand you, game. I didn't turn either of those times, though. Like, it was just a one straight movement. Oh, you're thinking maybe that... Oh, maybe if you have to turn to move to that square, maybe it counts as another movement point. That actually might be it, yeah. I mean, so he's probably dead now. Yeah. I guess I'll shoot him again. I mean, I like how it was actually giving me another turn there. I could have just shot him again. Anti-missile charges. All right. You have a point there. However, can unless I miss something, I could miss. I could be missing something because I'm a derp sometimes. But the game isn't telling me how much something's going to cost until I do it, right? You guys aren't seeing when I move, like, it's telling me, oh, it's going to cost that much. Like, I don't see it anywhere. 
I don't see it telling me how much it's going to cost. I could be wrong, but... What, wait, hold on. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, it does tell you. The arrows on the ground let you know. So, like, moving forward would be one, but if I move over here, because I have to turn, it's two. Okay. So, you know, instead of abstract arrows, it'd be nice if it was just, like, numbers. I didn't even notice that. The game probably should have told me about that. Like, look at the arrows on the ground and know how many points something costs. It would have been kind of nice. Oh, so I have anti-missile things now. Hmm. I'm gonna go here and then turn. I have an idea. Oh, he didn't. Damn it, he didn't enter into my trap. What? Oh, I dodged. I guess I dodged that. Interesting. I guess weapons are independent, as long as I'm facing the right way, I don't... Okay, okay, I only shoot one weapon at a time, but... Can I use an AMD? I guess, I guess not. Are the AMDs auto-triggering? I think the AMDs are just auto-triggering. Interesting. They seem very reliable. Well, whatever. He should run out of missiles, too, right? Because now I'm out of long-range missiles, which means he's probably out of long-range missiles. I think I'm right. Let's see if I'm right. I'd like him to walk into my line of fire for the cannon. That's what I'm trying to help, hoping he does. You out of missiles, buddy? Aha, you are. You're trying to get closer. So actually, I could just bait the eye uh, to get into my range, and then I could shoot him. Now, if he doesn't line up, I'll just back up a bit. Oh, where's he going? All right, I'm gonna see where he's gonna take this. Where, where are you going, buddy? We're st you're still on my range, so I don't know what you're up to. <laughs> what is this AI doing? Oh, wait, what? Wait, what? What happened? What happened there? What? I'm sorry? Was there a turn limit or something? And then the game just un unceremoniously dumped me out? If there, is a, if, if there was a turn li limit, it wasn't very clear about that. Well, I think there is actually a turn thing, but... Let's see here. No, that's not a turn limit. That's just a timer. What happened there? I'm, I'm very confused. Well, since this can be played online, perhaps that was like, uh, you haven't done a move in a few turns, so we're gonna kick you for, like, you know, being a jerk. I don't know. Oh, I, oh I'm in range, but I'm there. Okay. Didn't actually know that. Alright. Yeah, maybe it's just like an AFK type or, of sorts. That'd be kind of understandable, I suppose. Again, though, it should kind of tell you, like, hey, you're, you need to move or you're going to get kicked. But that's kind of weird, though. Isn't that weird, like, in a, in, a, in a tactical game like this? Isn't that... Am I, am I crazy to say that's kind of weird? Because, like... Like, it, wouldn't it be a strategy to stay put if the enemy is, like, trying to bait you or something? I, I would think it'd be a reasonable strategy to not move for a few turns. But then again, I don't play a lot of turn-based games, so is that maybe the cheap thing to do? It just seems kind of logical to me. The fine game. I can, I can bite. I'll, I'll, move, I'll move occasionally. How's that sound? You've activated my trap card! Oh, 
Stomp didn't do that. He's like, hey, that dude, that wasn't cool. Oh god, he's, he has one too. Right, is that how you want to play it? Alright. Uh, face my left arm, yeah. Aha! You can't return fire now. Let's see, I'll think again. I guess that'll work. Hello, Rena. What's he doing? Uh, I guess I can move. No, hold on. I'm gonna wait for it. What is he doing now? Not for love of God. Now he's just patrolling. I'm making sure my weapon arm is facing it, because if he shoots me in the body, I'll die. So, okay. I mean, I'm being, very, I'm being cautious here, because he could kill me if I'm not careful. You're not that late, Rena. You know, like, the people that show up, like, right when I'm closing the stream or something. You can- oh shit, you can shoot me from there. Alright. Well, the joke's on you. I can shoot you from there too. Ah! Oh wait, hold on. Uh... There. Thank. Alright. Hmm. Yeah, neither of us want to get close to the other one. <laughs> Alright, I'll give it two squares to... Alright, hold on. Let, let him... Let him move a bit. See, now I'm scared about just, like, not moving, because the game can just boot me for it. I need to worry about my positioning more than attacking, so... Come on, get in range. There you go, now we're gonna attack. He's gonna hit me in the arm, hopefully that's okay. I don't... Okay, I lost that arm, it's fine. Dead. I defeated Sierra. Screw all those adventure games they make. New location, alright. Alright. Lock the warehouse and store. All right. Uh huh. Okay. Okay. I see. All right. I don't want to. I don't want to unlock more slots for them. I want to unlock this. I like the cannon, so I'm going to buy that. Alright, hold on. Wait. Why can't I, uh... Hmm. All right. I just want I just want more I just want more cannon bolts. Can I have more cannon bolts? So I think I'll just buy some armor. There we go. 
I'm actually kind of confused. Oh, wait, hold on. Okay, so I just can't use these new slots I bought? Cool. Uh, save. Oh, wait. Oh, do we have to save first? Is that the trick? Nope, that didn't change it. Well, alright. Okay, I don't know how to actually add cannon. I bought more cannon shots. Game's not letting me use them. Alright. Nothing? I have ammo, so that's not the problem. Ugh, whatever. Oh, is it range? Shit, what's I? God damn, it's so hard to tell when I'm in range. Okay, I'm not in range right now. Now I'm in range. Can you only set in a set? In well, I mean, I I bought new slots. There were open slots, but I couldn't use them. If you notice. that arm. Can I rail? I'm actually dubious. Can I railgun over that? No, I can't. Okay. I mean, maybe after this bat, maybe if something was glitched after this battle, maybe I'll be able to. Is this just how? Is this just what we're doing now? All right. Missiles too, isn't he? Oh, well, that guy! I'm excited. With him running up to me. All right, can I? Yeah, I can do that. Does the lady do more damage, you think? I don't care. I need to turn my left arm towards him after I do this. Where are you going? I thought. Then I will, uh, let's see, how do you, I guess face that way? Yeah, there we go. This is so odd. Alright, oh, you're walking right up to me now. Alright, is that how you want to do it? Sure, that's a good idea. I think his body has two armor left, so you know what? I'm just gonna. Hmm. Wait, you're not dead? Uh. Shit. Um. Turn. I hope that counts as my left arm. I think it did? I don't know. Yeah, it's kind of the left arm. Okay. What a jerk. 
Oh, he's blocking with his arm. Of course he is. There, fuck your arm. Alright, I'm gonna... There. Hey, come back here. <laughs> Alright. That's what I thought. <laughs> Goodbye, another mech. That's cool. I would really like to just... I would really like just to have more... Oh, look, now I have full cannon shots. There we go. It just wasn't letting me do it. Oh! Oh! Hey, look. It's... it's. It, I know the problem. I had too much of other stuff, so I, I was too heavy, I guess. I understand now. It makes more sense now. What if I like... Yeah? Hmm. Wait, let's see. The can's on the right arm, correct? Seems to be. So I'd like the right arm to have more arm than the left arm. There we go. That makes a lot more sense now. Again, though, would be kind of nice if there's like a weight, you know, like a weight stat, and then it's like, oh, you know, you're over the weight, so you can't, you know, you hit the weight limit, so you can't put more stuff on, and then it'd be more obvious. Again, this game could just use little UI quality of life improvements, in my opinion. Yeah, I guess, uh... I'll do. <laughs> Fat shaving. I can create a skirmish now. Got added a bit today. Oh wow, miss! Thank you. Hey, let's see if we can get a player to fight us. Ronaldo. Yes, I'll fight Ronaldo. Is he a player? I don't. I don't know actually now. If he doesn't instantly take his turns, he's probably a, a player. Again, I don't know. Could maybe not be an answer. Hmm. This map's harder to use the cat at all, but I think I can still do it if I'm smart. Actually, I know what the I know what I'll do. Still just out of range. Alright. The first ad gave you a hundred? Nice. Well, I, I think he's not a player, the way he's moving. Why did I only have one AMD that time? Eh, whatever. Try to stay away from me so he can't. Is that him moving back in range? Hmm. Oh wait, I, didn't, I meant to attack. Whoops. That's okay. Wait. Oh, I'm terrible. I'm still in range for him. All right.
wonder how many long range missiles he has. Barely more than but more than me. Well that's kind of obvious though. I think he's out of them yet? Okay, hold on. Just gonna take it. Come on, get over here. That's what I thought. You're out of missiles, aren't you? Come on, over here. There you go. You've activated my trap card. Again. However, if I want to be very clever, I'll move one square. He's like, why'd you do that, dude? That was mean, dude. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna turn this way. Oh, wait, what you gonna do? Aha. Getting cold feet already, are we? Alright, let's see. Did that put him in range? No. Let's wait. What's he doing? What is he doing? Seriously. Alright, whatever. That's uh, gonna cost too many move points, though. I guess that's fine. What's weird about those missiles, they come up in the- they like fly up in the sky, which makes me think they always will hit your- on the head. But you can- you can arm block them, it's weird. I wouldn't expect you could arm block them, considering they- They do kind of land on your head and all, but alright. Gotta be careful here, I don't want to lose my railgun. Make sure I turn... Um, the other direction, I guess? Will that work? I think that'll work. I'm still a little bit leery about how you exactly need to turn to avoid... ...taking hits to certain parts, so it's still a little weird to me. Well, honestly, this arm is completely... Not needed, so I'll just, I'll just waste it. Uh oh. See, does he still have? He still has this cannon too. All right. Maybe smart about this then. There. You. You're not dead yet, but... Oh, wait, you are dead. Shoot him again! Okay, I gotta shoot him again. I have unlocked the campaign. A series of missions connected by a single story. It's weird how... Okay. Oh, what? Um, daily bonus. Okay, sure. I'm... Oh, oh. Look, I just keep running out, so let's fight like ten already. I don't care. I mean... It's not a bad weapon, or not a bad, not a bad game. Just take a little bit of, uh... Takes, I mean, it's not bad, it's not bad, like I said. Just, uh, a little bit plain, I guess, you know? That's the main problem here. It's not terribly exciting, I guess you could say. I guess, I mean, theoretically, it's online. Did I, I don't think I defeated... I don't know if I was defeating a player there or not. It's hard to tell. 
But uh, yeah, I guess unlock campaign. But honestly, I'm kind of bored. I'll be perfectly honest. Uh, it's just all right. Yo, I'm just gonna go to this. I'm gonna do the battle real fast because I'm just curious. It does seem like there are more than 1v1 matches, but man, this is kind of slow. It's like it starts you off a 1v1, very simple. It wants you to go. It wants you to unlock things as you go. You know, it, the more complex stuff will be unlocked later. But uh, well, quite frankly, it's kind of it's kind of a bit of a dull, dull, slow going. I'm not really a huge fan of that. Robotic animals would make it more interesting. I agree. Oh, look at this, look at this guy. He doesn't want to get close to me. Somebody's a scaredy cat. I just want to shoot with a cannon. I can keep blocking though, so it doesn't really matter. Too. Okay, now now he's in, now he's uh, now he's gonna get it. Dude, right in the back. And then I will face my left arm towards him because that's not the important one. There we go. So he'll probably return fire. So, I right, move square four. That's fine. I can move square four too, buddy. To Tokyo Jungle. I actually have. I've wanted to play that. Actually, just never got around to it. Move two squares and okay. That's fine. I can I can follow suit. Like this. I don't know if you wanted that, buddy. Oh, you have, wait. You suddenly had three armor. He had two a second ago. All right, I'm confused. But all right. All right. So you face my right arm towards you. So I'll just that. Alright, go ahead. Ah, you shot a missile I can defend against those, you fool. It's like, I think he's just gonna accept it. Oh no, I have been defeated. <laughs> Alright, yeah, it's, I mean, I like using the cannon, so I don't know what to say. So that was a, that was a campaign mission, and I guess the faceless one successfully infiltrated the Russian company's HQ and found Voris, the head of the minion, already dead. So that's, so story mode is basically just the same thing, except if you get a little story stepping before and after. Oh uh, man, this is, it really is just a case of being dull. This game is just kind of dull. Wait, hold on. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Okay. I was going to say, I saw these buy buttons. I was like, wait a minute, can I buy with real money? No, no, fortunately not. It's, a tr it's extreme service. That's much more reasonable. All right. But yeah. It's, uh, like I said, it's okay. It's not bad. It's just, uh, not great either, you know? It kind of exists. But, yeah. I think I'm done. I don't feel like continuing. So let's move on to another game. But yeah, this was Tech Wars Online. Uh, I played Tech Wars Online too. It was a completely different game type, which is kind of weird, but... Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna cute game. Uh, because that's what I feel like doing now. 